Hey guys, Fabulik here today, and welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. Um, so there was apparently a huge fire here at some point, and it took a while to put- Anyway, there, there was a fire there. Uh, so I don't think I actually did much between these two episodes. I was gonna do some more stuff around the lake, but I haven't gotten around to that yet. Those trees still look kind of gross. I was messing around with it a bit, but it just didn't turn out okay. What I did do though, which I've now undone because it didn't work, I was messing around with the roads here downtown to see if we could sort of ease up the traffic a little bit. Because it's mostly, well, it's like, well, obviously this main road here, it's basically this triangle of roads and sometimes down here a little bit that really, uh, they really lock up. And I think what annoys me the most is most of the cars, actually, they don't seem to be doing it now, but a lot of the cars will sit in this one lane all the way up and then they'll be in the one lane and then they'll change somewhere up here rather than using the lanes. Because uh, I tried basically upgrading this to two lanes on this side, four lanes on that side to see if that would help. Uh, they only used one lane, so that turned out to be completely useless. I also basically I disconnected like the front of the train station to see maybe if we sort of don't have this big triangle of roads, maybe it will get the traffic to go around just so it's a little bit better. But I don't know. Like I need to find a solution there that works, and it's going to take more time than what I did. I did spend like an like an hour to two hours trying that out. It just did not work. So basically, we're going to ignore that, and I'll <laughs> I'll continue trying to solve that on my own because that's going to take a while to get the right balance. Now. Uh, we want to continue down over here. I want to build out this area quite a lot. And I think we got to do it carefully because we already have, I mean, this, this road here, like it's not actually not too busy. It should hopefully be okay if we do a very similar thing on the other side, but I don't, well, first of all, this railway is completely in the way. Oh, actually that's what I did. Oh no, I don't think I've done it in this save because I, I think I did that in the other one. Um, Oh, no, wait, no, 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 yeah, I did. I actually removed, the trains don't even stop here anymore because no one was using that. I was hoping maybe if we do an express train from the airport to the city, they'd use it, but they don't. Like, you'll see, they'll <laughs> come up here. There's literally no one here waiting for the train. They all use the subway, which is actually, it kind of is annoying because surely some people are getting the subway to the central station, right? Surely some of them could get the train, which is an express route. I mean, it kind of annoys me, but uh, it's just the way it is. What I'm going to do instead... Uh, I'm going to keep the train line just because it'll probably come in handy at some point. Uh, whether we take it somewhere else, which we might do. But I'm going to keep it elevated above, um, or like running behind these buildings. I'm just going to bring it back a little bit so we can keep it elevated all through here. Uh, and also so we can get some roads under it over this way. So I'm going to bring this because it actually, where does it, oh, it comes down over there. I guess it will have to touch the ground there and then it will come back up. So although it's kind of weird because then we'll have a, no, that, no, okay, that needs to stay on the ground. All right, well, let's get rid of this bit. So we're going to raise up, actually, you know what, before I raise it up, let me build up the roads that I want in. I'm thinking that I do continue this road, but, like, onto the other side of this, but it's just going to be so... Like, if there's traffic going to be coming from all, like, if there's a huge four-way intersection, that's going to be way too busy, I'm thinking. So maybe we even do the road, a main road from over here, and maybe one a little further, no, we can't do one there, because that's already got that road. The problem is we need to have enough connections uh, to the other side without overwhelming the other side. So what I've used by the looks of it, small oaks, like the default, and then maybe about 10 instead of, I think the default is 20. Let's just have, let me just do this first. Uh, do I have snapping on? I do. Why does it feel like it's not snapping? I don't know. Uh, does that look about the same? That looks about the same. Okay, so I don't want that there because I feel like that's probably not going to be a good idea. It might be. It might be a great idea that I'll find out at a later date. Anyway, I was thinking here, where we already have a crossing, bring this down as a main road. I will probably do something else with it, but at the moment, we'll just go straight along like that. Uh, then I might actually change some of these roads. Uh, no, actually, we'll keep, we'll keep them for now. We'll see how we go. Because it might, because we do have a lot of intersections here. Hopefully, it's not going to be too much, but we'll put that there for now. Um, I'm not going to have a connect here, but obviously, only one major road over this way is going to be... Not good enough. Maybe if we can get another bridge on this side somewhere. No, that's not going to work. The other thing we're going to want to do is kind of stuff like where we've got this bridge going across the highway that doesn't connect to it. Oh, you know what we could do? We could actually get a road here. I'm just trying to see what, like, what options we have. Uh, so let's grab this one, stick it on the ground. It's going to come, that railway is going to move. Uh, it's going to come straight through. So this will come through to the other side. It won't touch any of those highways yet. So this will just be a connection to this side, straight underneath. That's perfect. So that means we have one there. Um, I mean, which I guess is not really a great connection, but there is a bit of industrial there. So you could uh, you could get to that. Might be useful for some people. I don't know. Um, okay, so there's one there. Really need one down this side somewhere. I guess we could try. Although, to be fair, I don't think this is actually a very busy intersection anymore, considering uh, what I 
did to yeah it's actually really not busy because we did so many like overpasses around here to manage the traffic it's actually calmed down quite a lot and we also have this road that's bypassing everything so we might be able to get away with a road coming off of there but it might also be a bad idea but let's try it it might be a really 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 bad idea but we'll we'll see you know we'll get that there now this actually does need to somehow connect over to the main area which it currently has no possible way of doing because we've got that road in the way and the train line um, maybe we keep this road, because the thing is, I built these roads and the train line here, just, be, like, not just because, but, uh, just in a position. Okay, really? I can't upgrade to the, that road? Oh, I, I saw sometimes those buttons don't click properly. I always click on this, and then it, half the time it doesn't register it. Anyway, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do this. Uh, it looks a bit weird at the moment. That's fine. Probably up to that point, and then this train line... Is gonna be here, elevated, good, upgrade. So these are basically gonna swap positions, uh, which might sound weird, but uh, it'll make sense. So right now I'm gonna select all of these points, bring all these down. Um, it probably would have been, e you know what? It's probably gonna be easier just to rebuild it <laughs> than doing that. I've, I've just realized as I'm doing it, it's probably gonna be much more difficult to do it the way I was trying to do it just then. All right, so let me actually remove that bit. So this, where we are now, I think is probably the height that I want it to be at. Below everything else. It might be a little too low. I don't know. We'll see. So a little bit bigger about there. Because that will come under here somewhere. Underneath that rail. Is that... Uh, it's not actually low enough. Hmm. Okay. Fair enough. So we need to go a little bit lower. Because that's just not... Yeah, okay. Just a smidge. So whoop. There we go. That's probably enough. Yeah, that, that'll be enough now. Okay. Okay, then bring that way back up. There we go. So this height here. Mm -hmm. I think we're still okay with the... Look at... Oh my god. Look at that underneath. <laughs> uh, I actually did fix this one over here. Uh, I went back and sort of just replaced that whole curve there. So that, that one's all flat. I might... Like, this is ridiculous. I, I don't know. I might. I might fix that at some point but we'll see no promises okay so this now is going to come straight like this uh stick it on the ground please like that we we'll just make sure we're doing a straight slope click that a few times just so it works it's all right uh okay then we're going to come around here okay i don't need road guides thank you there we go that's going to come underneath to that point that looks good then we do need to, you know what, it would probably be a good idea to maybe not even connect up to that anymore. Because maybe we connect up, well I guess we could even connect up to this one. No, but this was a good bypass, but I, it just seems weird putting it there. Here's what we'll do. Uh, we'll bring it up. Um, so we have a railway here. Maybe, because the problem is if I put this road in here and it's going to be a highway, we're, gonna, we're basically going to block off the room between the, the rail and uh, the highway. So, well, let me try this. So if we, if we build this next to the rail, just so we're not taking any more room than we need to, that's going at the wrong angle. Mm -hmm. And then, can I just select this one? They love using Shaban for names of roads. I've seen that pop up so many times. Uh, it's going to be about, I seem to move this down a little bit. About there, just so it's a little bit more even. Okay, about there. Um, yeah, that's fine. Uh, and then just have it turn. So it's there. I don't, that rail's at a weird angle, so I'm going to redo that one as well. Then it will come up. How high is that? 10 meters? I think it's 10. 10 meters. Uh, it's going to be off the ground, obviously. Uh, actually, you know what? Can we just do that? We can't do that. All right, cool. And then I will actually probably raise this up a little bit. And maybe even that bit there. That's a bit better. And then I will just elevate that section. Well, it looks kind of weird that it's... That's eh, probably fine. I mean, I think this whole area is going to look weird anyway. So if we have it like this, okay. Then we go like this like this just a little bit like just just a little bit like this just so we can sort of have it running through and looking absolutely fantastic um actually that's not too bad i'm just gonna fix the curve obviously mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. there we go 
Ah, oh, lovely. Yeah, except for that. Um, probably, probably could redo this, but I think for now, for now, I don't know why I said it like that. I think for now, that's pretty good. All right, so that'll do. So now that road just comes up, that also, so basically that doesn't just eat up all this space now uh, with the road right in the way. And then this, this road here should be able to, I have to come across, um, well, obviously I have to curve it a little bit. Let's get this in. So I, basically what I want to do is kind of like what we did over here on those episodes is just build a whole area of roads and then we'll go from there. You know, we'll see, see where we're at after that. So I think this is going to come like this. Is that, oh, actually, yeah, well, because the beach is... I'm going to have to change. This can't all be sand because it looks ridiculous because it's like so high above the ground. Um, I'll change most of that. We'll keep like obviously beach down the bottom, but up the top it looks a little stupid, I think. Well, you know, no, hang on. You know what? Same same height as that. It doesn't need to be any higher. There we go. Uh -huh. And then we'll like smooth out that. All right, let's get the road in and then we'll figure out the rest. So this is going to come across uh, like, so maybe even as a bridge. Or is that just not going to really work? I mean, it could, but I just don't like the look of that bridge. You know what? Let's just go elevated. Nope. Elevated. I wish that... It'd be nice if you could put a, a pole in somewhere, but I guess it doesn't really want to, does it? Do it there. Give a support there, I guess. Oh, what the hell is that? <laughs> Why did that build it so strangely? <laughs> How odd. Um. All right, fine, fine. To there. Alright, so that's also quite odd that it goes. What is happening over here? <laughs> what what is happening over there? I didn't, that was weird. Uh road guard that uh, can you just that's better. Now that rail looks like it's absolutely gonna hit that road. So we do need to bring this a little bit lower, which is fine, we can do that. Actually, you know what? Don't do that. What we'll do is we'll select all the points on the, the hill except for the first one. Especially because it Looks like it should be flat there, just because the way that sort of levels off, and then it goes up, which is fine. So it means we can do this, and then I'll get that point there around the corner. Bring that down a little bit too. Bring that down a little bit. There we go. Okay, that's probably fine. Um, those should be the same height, but it, for some reason, definitely looks like it's going up. Like, I'm pretty sure I leveled these two off, right? Like from, whoops, that's not the level tool. Stop that. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I just selected that point, but I didn't actually. Yeah, I didn't. I guess I didn't. It's a little bit lower. Maybe I'll just rebuild that. Cause that's uh, it's getting a bit getting a bit strange. Uh, let's build the bridge first, then everything else. Let's do that. Uh, so first of all, reset that. Uh, then I do want that. Okay, so elevated from here-ish. I don't know why I have road guides, and also I don't know why that was trying to do a tunnel. How strange. Like that. That looks better. Well, let's put some... Oh, because that's where a pillar would have been. So it's done a bit of cement. Interesting. Well, not really interesting. Kind of annoying more than anything. All right, so... <laughs> yeah, kind of just annoying. Uh, okay. So this is going to come out. This won't curve that nicely down to it now. No, oh, I guess it's fine. What we'll do... Like this. Where is a road going? At? We can go up to... Oh, okay. About there. About there. Then... Uh, maybe do it the other way. Like that or something. Yeah, that works. We'll just have like that. And then we can sort of fill in the area. Okay, so then up here, this really, 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 really cannot be sand. Because that looks ridiculous, basically. Uh, most of this should, probably shouldn't be. It just goes back a little too far. This bit's probably fine, because most of that is actually quite flat. Um, it's just all because I think... I don't know if it was always raised up this much, but... It is now, and I think the sand is going too far up. I don't know what I'm going to do with those cliffs down there. I guess we've got to put stuff in there at some point. All right, so this is going to come down this way. I've said this a lot. But now, so if we have a few major roads, so this one's going to come... Is this going to be straight? Or, yeah, let's just go straight up until there, along the, where the beach is going to be. And then we can get... So this is going to come... I'm going to give it a little curve. So it sort of curves back toward the beach a little bit. And it's going up there for some reason, so <laughs> let's not do that. Yeah, that's a bit better. Um, so if we're going to have the road... Hang on. Let's get this about as... Just... Oh my god. About there, okay. 
We get the road. It'll go down like there somewhere. So then just so we can get like a nice, hopefully, oops, good looking slope of some sort. Now, I don't know if I want to use this road. Probably not with trees. What? I mean, I like it along there, but maybe not here. So we, over there, I mean, we did use, we use that sort of large avenue, but I guess it's kind of up the top at the moment, isn't it? Hmm, I don't know what kind of road I want to use there. Maybe we could use... I could do a monorail. Actually, yeah, that's a good point. Speaking of public transport, I was just about to say you know, the monorail. Uh, because I... I don't know that would it'd be useful getting an... I mean, it'd be good getting another subway line in, but it doesn't really make sense, because all it would do is go here and then just connect back up at Laurel Square. I mean, I guess you could have the green line come through as well. But it would just be a line that does this. Because I, I, I assume it would connect at Laurel Square, because otherwise there's no point going any further. Because um, it does the same thing. I guess what you could do, you could go subway line through this area and then go through Laurel Square, maybe connect through up to whatever that spot is and then through across the... Ba you know what? Let's do that. Because then you have a line doing that goes up. Or is that just a weird line because it's not really in a... I mean, I definitely want, I definitely want one going from the city over, like, underneath this bridge, because we've actually, we've essentially gotten rid of the cable cars. The original buildings are still there, but the cable cars aren't there anymore. They just didn't have high enough capacity. I'm actually just going to get rid of them now. They didn't have high enough capacity. Too many people preferred to use that over my other public transport, so it was kind of annoying. Um, <laughs> so I just got rid of it. Um, yeah, it was, it was annoying. Uh, the other thing, is, oh, yeah, oh, where is that, um, there's a fantastic, uh, comment, um, Hang on. Let me see if I can find it. There was a great comment that... Uh, I just want to see who did it. And they, they made like a public transport map uh, of the city, like with the new revamps. And it was awesome. It was really, really cool. I, just wanna, I don't often shout out people's names just because if I do it once, everybody asks for it. But this definitely deserves it. Um, Suleiman Ahmed made a public transport map, uh, which hopefully I'll link in the description down below. So click on the, the link in the description. It's just an image, but it's like a map of the public transport system we have going on with the subways, the trains, the monorails, and it's like all like really neatly done. It's awesome. It's really, really cool. I love it. Um, anyway, so thanks for that, man. That was really cool. Uh, okay, so yeah, maybe we, I was thinking maybe we do that because uh, that would also, because this is probably going to be a high density area as well. So maybe that's an idea. That's an idea, but I don't think we'll get around to that this time anyway, but uh, keep that in mind. Okay, so we have one, two, three, I guess, technical roads, but that's not really a bit. So we have two, let's just say we have two main connections at the moment. The problem is, the problem, the big problem with this area is there's no highway connection right now. Sure that this is a highway, but it's only a highway really up until this point where it starts hitting there. Okay, well, this is another thing. I need to, I need to keep pointing this out to people because... The, the thing is, we do, these are highways, and we have highways like this in Sydney, where it, it's called a highway, it has intersections on it, and it goes like that. Like, it does, it's not like a, like this, if you go, okay, this would be like a motorway or a freeway, depending. A motorway, if you, if it's a toll road, a freeway, if naturally, it's free. And then the highways are these roads that are large avenues that have intersections. That's just what it's called. Anyway, so we do have highways here, but we don't have... Any, and it's kind of the same with the city. We don't really have a direct motorway connection. I mean, actually, I guess we do because this road here doesn't have any actual intersections on it. It used to, but we got rid of it, the one there, um, until it gets to this point. And then, it, and then it stops being a freeway. We do have the freeway that goes under the water, which I found it really funny, actually. Someone's like, that's really unrealistic or something. Uh, get rid of it. And I'm like, well... No, it's not, because we have a tunnel exactly like that in Sydney. <laughs> it's called the Sydney Harbour Tunnel, which happens to be a freeway that goes under the harbour. Anyway, that's not the point. So, yeah, so that comes out here. We could, inst well, I mean, we could keep it coming out there. That could be a regular exit, but maybe we continue the tunnel over here somewhere, which I'm thinking is probably going to be a good idea. The problem is it's bloody underground, so it's going to be difficult to try and do an intersection, um, which we, we can absolutely do. Because I think that would probably be the way to go get a tunnel over to this side. Because there's no other obvious connection. There's not really room to get an above ground highway. I mean, we could... No. So we could... I mean, there's this this technically, uh, like the motorway going here. But that's only a two-lane thing. I mean, we could, use, we could use something like that. But I think that's a bit unrealistic for such a high density... Well, a 2B such high density area. So maybe let's go... Uh, okay, no, let's build this road first. I'm getting... Just trying to figure out what the best way to go is about this. Let's just build using this median strip road. Not underground. 
We're going to build along the waterfront first. Uh, get rid of road guides. I'm going to come down this way. That's awful. Really, really awful. But we'll sort that out. Then this is going to be, this is basically going to be the waterfront road. Kind of like, well, the beachfront road. Kind of like we have over the other side. I'm going to smooth all that out as well because that does not look good. I'm going to come all the way along the beach. Uh, not to the airport, though. That's probably not a good idea. <laughs> we'll probably stop about here. I guess we can have this road here, um, which is actually a little high-density road, which is good. So we're going to get this one. Um, why is that at minus two, that whole... I guess that's fine. We'll just smooth out the land. So if this road comes directly... You know what? Let's actually go here, and then we're going to... Let's keep that rock there. Let's go around the rock. Oh, it's not going to let me, is it? I want to go, like, right in... You know what? Get out of my way. Get out of my way. I'll put you back in a second. Um, no, I don't want to do a curve like that. And then, I don't know, something like just straight ahead there. Then put this back. There you go. It's like, I oh, know there's a rock. Oh, no, now there's a little rock in the middle of the road. Hmm. Okay, that didn't really work. If that rock wasn't... Okay, what about this way? Hmm. Hmm. Do it that way. There you go. Lovely. There's a rock. Oh no, we have to turn around. Whoa! Alright, so then that's our airport there, which should be fine. Um, yeah, that doesn't hear anything on the way in. Alright, so as long as we don't... I don't think we'll build on this side of the road, unless we do like a field or something. We should probably do a fence um, around the airport. Let's do that. Just a basic one for now. Let's say, what fences do we have? We have like, prison fence, which is probably what you would use for an airport. So I think I will use this. Because um, it has barbed wire, basically, is the reason I would suggest using it. Um... Can we get this? I can't really see what I'm doing. That's a, that fence looks real small compared to like the key. Now I don't think it's probably necessary to go all the way around, so I can't be bothered. We'll just go up to that point. Um, get rid of that one because that looks weird. Uh, okay, that's not joining. There we go. I guess it's going to do that, isn't it? Uh, we could just do something like this behind all these trees because it doesn't need to be too far away like that that's far enough away that it should be fine what well why did that just build that i didn't i don't know why i did that uh okay so it should be like that um and then let's go here no what stop trying to build from there build from that point there we go that can come through i don't know around here somewhere it's not it's not a science at the moment. Like, I'll probably go through and fix it up. Anyway, I'm just going to do that for now, just so we don't go past that point. It's kind of more for me. But anyway, so it'll be like that. Okay. Cool. And then this road is going to go uh, right about here. Okay, don't be at minus two meters, please. So I've got like that. Um, might even just keep it like that. Now, yeah, all of this is kind of... For some reason, it's all sunken down, which is kind of annoying, but we, we, we can deal with that. We can deal with that. Uh, if we go... Just smooth most of that out. It should be fine. And then also on the beach is a little bit... I don't know why. I mean, I guess we can have a cliff on the beach. Just I don't want it on all of it. So that's a bit better on this one. Okay. So if the road come around like that, a little, little bit of a cliff there. You know, it's some, something a bit a bit inter interesting. A little bit of a cliffhanger, if you will. <laughs> um, we could even have... An exit onto this road, or maybe we'll, maybe we'll do like an exit here or something. Not an exit, but like maybe another junction, just to sort of service that area. Whether that's a good idea or not, I am not sure. Probably not. Actually, let's not do that. <laughs> I've immediately regretted that decision. Um, so this is going to come to that. I'm now wondering if we could get a bridge. That'd be good because then you'd have another connection. But there's nowhere for this to go. Um, is the problem? Like we maybe here. If we went like, the problem is it has to go above all of this, uh, which I think, I can't remember what height it needs to be, because you can see the ferries there, like how high it has to be. Um, I think it was like, looks like 15 meters that rail is anyway. So let's say 15 meters. So from there to there. Then it needs to go there to there somehow, but it's way too steep. So I don't know how we could get a bridge in but it would be great it, it would be really really good because then you just have another point of connection 
Especially then you could avoid that bridge up there and all of that. Oh man, I want to do this. Okay, so I think maybe if we go here, so I'm just going to have to go obviously through some of these buildings and join up there maybe. Let's go 15 meters. So from here to here, already occupied by what? What are you already occupied by? Prick. Um, why is it like, hang on, just go straight across. Why is that, uh, maybe, cause maybe it needs to be higher. Higher? 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 Okay, it's not, need, it's not needing to be higher. I just don't know why it's supposedly already occupied. Oh, because it's trying to put a pillar in the middle. That's probably why. All right, forget all that. Uh, okay, so we're going to come over this way. We're going to come into this little bit there. I, I reckon about there is probably where we want to be. Let's go straight across. Um, is that even straight across? I can't even tell. Maybe. Sure, why not? Uh, okay, this is going to come over here. Preferably not destroying... Okay, get off the bloody grid. No, there we go. I was going to say, preferably not destroying that ro that pathway we've put in there, because we spent a lot of time trying to do that. We're down to seven meters at that point, without destroying the pathway, which is good. Oh. Except we definitely cut off their heads. We might just move the pathway a little bit. And then that will go there. Okay. Uh, so that's obviously way too steep at that point. So let's go about like... It needs to be more like that. And then this basically <laughs> needs to not be there. Um, okay, hang on. So we go that one. And that one. Mm -hmm. Move them over here instead. Uh, that one, and, nope, and this one, please, move that, yeah, those palm trees are all in the wrong spot, but we'll worry about that later. So if it comes along here, uh, that's fine, actually, there's plenty of headroom now, which is good. Okay, so get rid of these. Now, I think these trees are part of this, which kind of sucks, but, because it, it kind of sucks, we can't really do anything about it. But I'm going to have to... Because I just want to avoid that fence, so that's why I'm just curving it here a little bit. So something like that. Yeah, there's just random bushes there because it's, <laughs> it comes as part of that. All right, anyway, so we can do a bridge like this, which is actually pretty good. Because uh, that will allow us to go up like so. Might actually stick that on the ground, though. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not that first bit. Hang on, let me do a crossing about... No, not there. There? Really? Might let me put it there? Okay, that would have been that would have been too easy. But I'll do this. I'll move it myself. Whoa, that does not look good. <laughs> Whoa! All right, bring that up. There you go. And then basically what I'm trying to do is just so we can. No, why is it still on move it? I'm not on move it anymore. Stop it. No, not that bit. Ah, oh, you prick. Sometimes it's just a bit, a bit, a bit annoying. Okay, bring that down so it's level. Then it goes up. Okay. Maybe we should even bring this down. So it's like more actually at that level. And then we'll obviously adjust the land around it. Okay, you know what's going to be easiest to rebuild this? So bring that... Ah, Sabrina Walker Street. Uh, okay, so get rid of this bit. Because it's... Okay, let's go level off to that point there. Obviously bring down the strength a lot. Bring down the size a lot. Maybe strength up a little bit. Because it's probably going to be too weak. There we go. Okay, so all through here will be now at this height, just because it's going to be easier for us to sort of manage stuff and build stuff, which is good. Um, all right, so like that. There you go. Lovely. Let's get rid of all of that. Uh, we probably want to at least smooth that somehow because that's going to be a little bit too steep. That should be okay. okay get rid of that bit because now we can actually just go like this with the road. Instead of, yeah, stick it on the ground. Uh, make sure it's still on the ground here. Um, maybe not like that. What the hell happened there? That was weird. <laughs> I don't know what I just did at that point, but it kind of got messed up. Uh, okay. So, uh, what the balls is going on? Like, I know I know, I clicked by accident, but I don't know why it built it like that. <laughs> that was a weird accidental build. I don't know what I'm doing. Let me turn off Anarchy, first of all. Because it's probably not helping us. Um, that's probably fine. Just straight through like that. 
Yeah, cool. I don't know why I'm doing this one with the grass median strip, but I am. That's just the way it is, all right? All right. So that's going to come through like that. Lovely. Okay, so now we have a connection there. One up there. Which is good. Or a nightmare. I don't know. Again, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. This is all a trial and error. Now this road is going to come down. I guess this is probably going to be one that just goes all the way through. Maybe. Why is that raised up the entire way? Like, I don't understand this game sometimes. Like, why is it doing that? Just stay on the ground. That's better. Okay. Like that. So now we have one, two, three sort of spoke roads. I guess four if you count that one. And then maybe we can just base everything off of these roads. So car there's cars coming this way. I wonder if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> I'm not sure yet. Depends how much traffic goes this way. Okay. Man, it's taking a long time to do this. Hey. Uh, okay. So we want to basically do similar things over there. So let's get out. Uh, we probably want to use... You know what? I might actually use... Cycle lane roads? We do have cycle lane roads. Let's use these. Use these. Because then they can just cycle all the way down the beachfront. Which is good. That's probably what we want. Alright, so you can come all the, oh, all the way around. To that point there. That's going to go up to there. Okay, cool. Uh, this one then is going to be changed into a cycle lane road from, I guess, that point. Because the thing, I guess the thing is, like, we don't, what do we need trees on roads for? We can have um, trees next to roads, right? So, there. Suck on that. Uh, okay, so then, I'm going to go upgrade. Make sure it's elevated. All of that. Lovely, it's destroyed my pathway. Thank you, game. <sighs> How rude. Um, okay, get this back in. I think it was just a regular one. Stick it on the ground. There you go. Okay, don't snap to the other one, thank you. There you go. Sure, that'll go there. Alright, so now they can cycle all the way along. Lovely. We'll be cycling all the way down the beachfront, and it'll be great! Now, uh, it'll probably be a good idea. Let's get, uh, let's get some other roads coming up here, but... Let's go one way. So we definitely want some more roads coming off here somewhere, but if we do a one-way road... Maybe, okay, turn snapping back on. From there. Well, yes, it's a close intersection. It, I was going to say, it shouldn't have traffic lights, but it absolutely does. I don't know why. It doesn't need them. Because you just... What you want to do... Okay, first of all, don't bloody turn right from that lane. That's unnecessary. Just have one right-hand lane. Again, same on this one. One right-hand lane. So then, you know, if people are trying to turn right, they can just sit there and wait rather than... You know, waiting for the whole set of traffic lights to go. Because it just makes more sense. Okay, anyway, no one's going to go down there at the moment. Because there's literally no point. So that's fine. Alright, this is going to come down this way. So this will just add another point of entry. Which will be good. Um, now these can probably connect up. Not all of them. Because that would just be ridiculous. Let's connect up this second one. I'm going to go through. Like that. So this won't connect up. But it'll go to like, there-ish. Well, maybe, I don't know, like, this grid seems pretty fine. Like, the, all of these roads are all connected, except for when you get back a little bit and it starts getting a little bit more interesting, but most of them seem to be okay. I don't know. Oops. About there. A little, bit of a little curve. I guess this one will be connected. Let's just roll with that. Where's the road guide for that one? About there. Maybe about there. I don't know. I mean, it's definitely not parallel, just because the way I know that I built that a little bit off, but that's fine. Um, okay, so let's go off of this road. Through to here, I guess. I think it's going to look weird before stuff's built on it, and I think that's kind of the point. Well, it's not really kind of the point, but it's just the way we're doing it. All right, so we've got roads there. Um, okay, the thing is, we just want to fill up this entire area. Now, I guess I'll keep this as a... Why don't we make a one-line... Wait, do they have a one-way bike lane road? <laughs> of course they don't. All right, so one-way tree line road then, in that case, because they don't have um, the other one, Large Oaks. Let's go that way. Ten. Is Large Oak too large, though? I feel like they're pretty big. I feel like they're pretty big... And we, do we really, really want oaks here? Because none, none of these trees are oaks. Maybe not. Those are the beech trees, right? Uh, no, it'd be, I assume it's alphabetical. 
Oh, I assumed wrong. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> I definitely assumed wrong. Yeah, it's not alphabetical at all. That would be that would just be a little bit too smart, wouldn't it? Um, hmm. Generic. Gen um, where's my beech tree? Uh, it's right at the beginning. Random oak. Isn't that what that is? Didn't we figure that out like last time or something? That that was the. No, maybe it was a white birch tree. That was definitely a beech tree. Hang on. Now I've forgotten. This one here, right? Small, oh, small beech. Uh, oh, okay. A little big, hang on. Yep, small, okay. Right, I probably went past it 10 times then. Lovely, all right, so small, oh, yep, there it is right there, sweet. Now, 10 is probably a little too close to this, I'm gonna assume, let's see. Uh, yeah, that's probably, it's probably a little too close. Especially if we're gonna be doing a sort of an urban, this is not gonna be like a sprawling suburb, it's gonna be downtown urban kind of thing. Let's do that. There we go. I might actually leave these, maybe have those ones when you come in as grass and then down this way. Oh, this is gonna go all the way down to there, I guess. And no, that's not gonna do that because it's just made that all go down for some reason. Uh, no, don't go minus three. Let's go to this point and then do it. There you go. Lovely. Now, look look at that. Blends in. It does it is a little bit sunken, I do realize, but whatever. Too late for that now. That's just the way I've done it. Okay, so then, uh, through here, we'll just have some of these uh, roads. Small beach. Shut up, you beach. <laughs> so stupid. Um, yeah, I kind of... No, you know what? We'll keep using the cycle lane roads, because these are good. Alright, so I don't want them super close. Maybe something like this. And then this one might continue down like that. But it's not going to be at minus three. And then it might even, I guess, we'll turn at this point, maybe. So if that's 90 degrees there. Don't go minus one, thank you. Then this will come through. Like that, so it joins up more like that. So that one curves through, but this one doesn't, which is interesting. I think it, 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 the thing is, I think this is my philosophy. Oh, not my philosophy, it's my theory. I think roads look way better when there's stuff built on them. And when you do them like this, they look absolutely weird. Like I think, like for example, over here where we've got all these buildings, it's like you look at it like this and say, like, oh, uh, I mean, apart from the fact that they're all the same building, that's kind of annoying, but I think this area is probably a better one than this one. I think that's probably got a little too much space in it, but I mean, it works, it works. Okay, so the, I think all these roads, we'll just continue these ones. Um, the way we've been doing them. So yeah, it's on the ground. It's gonna go straight ahead. Like that. And uh... Why are you trying to raise them up all the time? I don't know why it's obsessed with doing different heights. Like, I, I, I get it. Like, if a road's already lowered, like, or this one, I guess it's technically raised, it's at one meter. This one's at minus four there for some reason. Like, it, the mod will continue on at that height, which is frustrating, because I always forget to turn it off. But anyway, so these ones are the exact block size. So I think that's what we'll continue doing on these ones. Make sure it's not. I don't know if I want, no, I'll connect every other one on that side there because that is quite a big road. Why are you upset about more roads? I mean, I get it, I do, but why? <laughs> I get it, but I don't, so you're an idiot. And that'll come all, oh, hello. Oh, it's auto saving. I mean, auto save is great because it means nothing's gonna go wrong. I mean, it could still very much go wrong, but... Look at that. That might be a little too close to that bit there, but we'll see. Yeah, this is all, uh... Dipping and diving and, and all that. So that's gonna... Get, this one's just gonna connect straight on through. Same with these ones. All of these are just gonna go straight through. Probably not this one, though, because... <laughs> that's a little close, maybe. We'll probably leave that gap there. These ones will connect straight through, though. I don't know why these are at one meter height. Please don't be. Those will connect through. Again, that one won't, because there's no point. All right, so that's sort of that grid continued. Um, then maybe even this one just comes through. Although it might be better if we do something like this. Because then this row can actually, they can actually get through. Instead of joining there, they just join down at that one. That's probably better. Uh, this is actually going to be a smaller road. Maybe even a one way. We'll go like... This. This can connect down there. So there is a connection to the main road. 
Because, I mean, it's like, we got a pretty big run here of no roads, so it's probably all right. All right, so that'll fill in that section. Now, we actually, so basically at the moment, we've got a lot of residential, commercial, and a little bit of industrial. So we'll get some offices and all that. We'll get all the kind of, all the kind of varieties of stuff around here. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is going to, I'm going to continue these blocks. Uh, like, that's pretty good. They're not too, oh. If it didn't sink down on the ground, that would have been nice. Okay, stay above, and then we'll sink down when we get to that. I'll sink about it, okay? <laughs> oh, funny. <laughs> the, way, the way I said it. Ah, oh, funny. It's really not. Now, I think maybe if we even get this one to go through to there somewhere. Because then we can use this as a connection point for roads. Mm -hmm. Definitely not going to join that one through. This can maybe be a smaller road. And maybe there. Alright, so that will fill in that spot. Uh, then this little area in here, which is pretty... Pretty dense. I think I want to do it more this way, though. Line the buildings up like that. Uh, okay, go home. Bop. Pop. Bop. Now, I... Probably don't want to join that road there, so that'll pr uh, that'll probably be fine. Not quite there, a little bit further back, just so we can if we keep that full zoning there, like something like that, will probably be fine. Down this bit's getting a bit interesting. I think I think it actually does look kind of cool though, with all those roads at different angles. Um, I mean, whether it looks cool with actual buildings on it, well, I, I guess we'll find out. But right now, it seems okay. Um, so this is going to be on the ground. None of these are quite. Um, Right. <laughs> none of them, yeah, none of them are, Okay, turn off that. Turn off snapping as well. There we go. Quite right in the sense that none of these actually line up in a grid. They're close enough, though, which is kind of what I'm going for. Um, but we'll definitely have some connections through, because at the moment we don't have any. I think one there. That one there. So I'll just move them along. Maybe even one back this way a little bit. We don't want to have a direct pathway through. Like, we want the quickest route to be like this one over there, for example. Because, I mean, there are no traffic lights on this, so the cars can actually go all the way through. We might even do some, like, give way signs on some of these just so that they don't... Uh, so that this stays as, like, a priority road going through. This one will not connect to there. It'll be about there. Yeah, that's good. You know what? Let me um, base it off of this. I'm going to leave one grid in between. No. I'm going to leave a couple grid squares in between. Because I want it. Yeah, like that. That's good. Maybe from here to here, though, just so we have a connection. Yeah, that's all right, actually. That looks quite good. Get rid of that one, though. That'll connect up there as well. Uh, we'll have this one go through, maybe. Maybe that goes all the way through. But it doesn't keep going all the way up. Yeah, it's all right. Uh, it'd probably be, instead of doing roads through there, I might do some pathways to fill in that space, I think. This one can just come all the way through as well. Something like that. We'll keep that area open, I think. Maybe we can get a larger, unique building or something in there. I wonder if this can go through. I mean, it can, but whether that's... It's going to eat up a lot of zoning. Do like a one-way through here. Maybe like that. So if you're coming down this way, you can sort of one-way back through there. That's all right. Cool, and then we can get some parks in there as well. Okay, this is starting, it's starting to fill out. I think it's actually starting to look like something useful, like that we can build here with, you know? Got a nice curve there, but we're not curving the whole thing, because that would be just too much. Uh, oh, good lord. What? Why aren't these cars going, ever? Do these cars just not ever get a... What? Did I do, like, set up traffic lights here or something? Because it appears like they are never getting... Like, from what I can see right now, it appears that they are literally never getting a turn. I think I might have actually done time... Yep, I did do time traffic lights here. Uh, that would probably be it. Remove time traffic light. Let's go back to default. Because back in the day when it was really quite busy, this, I mean, it seems to be working... Like, I love, I absolutely love the fact they're using two lanes. That's amazing. If it can now flow correctly, that'd be perfect. Cool. All right. Anyway, now that I've noticed that, that's good to know. Uh, <laughs> that's good to notice. Now, I think I'm going to do one-way roads in from this one here, just so we don't have traffic lights. I mean, it'll probably create traffic lights, but we'll get rid of them. We go like a little bit further down though, about here. Yeah. This will go like that. Oh my God. Good lord, no, it won't go like that. <laughs> I mean, it will, but like I'll do it bit by bit so it doesn't look like that. So we want it to be 
Oh, actually, you know what? Turn off, turn, turn off, turn off straight slope. It should be better. There we go. Uh, so it's like a, it's a bit, a bit wavy. That's fine. So we'll have one way there. That's probably all we need off of that one. Um, and then we can have some roads coming off of here, which probably don't need to be one way because hopefully they shouldn't be too busy. So this is going to come through. You know what? Let me build it off of this road here so I can see what we're going to have. Hang on, a little bit further down. There, perfect. There. Yeah, so I even kind of like that with the sort of little cliff face there. So it's like that road wouldn't realistically join anyway. That's quite good. I should have on the road there. Let me move that back a little bit. Uh, there. Now that road is built a little bit differently. So I'm going to go like this. There we go. That I, I hate when it does zoning like that. Like it... Like, and the road is not even straight. Like, what, I, I don't understand why it does that. So can you just build the road like straight? Hang on. Turn off grid. Turn, oh, okay. No, wait. Let me go. Okay, first of all, build it on the ground. Turn off all the snapping. So let me just do it myself because I feel like when you do that, it just ruins it. So if I go to there myself and then do that bit. See, how come when I can do it myself, it's better? But then the game's like, oh, I don't know how to make a straight road. Woo! Stupid game. Sometimes it's stupid. Sometimes it's great. All right. So then we got a little space in here, which we can definitely get a road coming through on as well. Uh, maybe actually off of this one. No, you know what? Maybe even a small one way. This will come down. And we'll go across like that. And then this can just be a two-way lane that fills in that spot. This one can be a one-way that sort of goes up. And just to there. And we'll leave that spot. Okay. So that fills in that. I definitely feel like we should have something here. Maybe if we get like, um, probably have to level it out. Maybe if I get some like theme park assets or something, we build like a, a big theme park kind of thing there. That'd be cool. I reckon that's a cool idea. Maybe we'll do that. I like it. I already like it. I already like it and I haven't seen it yet. Uh, so this road is going to come up. This will be a somewhat main-ish road, I guess, in a way. Because it's sort of bordering the area, coming around like that. I guess we'll get some offices along there or something. Uh, and then... Get a road straight on through. Straight on through, pretty much. Yeah, just just pretty much filling that out. I think just like that. I don't know if I like that curve there, just because it does look it doesn't seem to really fit, but I think it's okay. Uh, so then we have this area in there. I just want to fill that up, and then we're probably done with roads uh, for the area. Then we're just gonna eventually fill it in and hope that the traffic doesn't die. Actually, what we might do before we do that was we'll do all the pathways and all that like we normally do. Now, that seems to have cleared out perfectly fine. So I, I don't think that... Well, currently, with nothing built here, this new connection is fine. <laughs> we'll see how it goes when there's more cars here, though, and more people living here. Now, if we can actually get a road from down the bottom... We currently have... I don't know why there's oaks on that. I, it really shouldn't be. Like, I... I don't know why I've done that with stuff. Like, I really should have been paying attention to what kind of roads... Or what kind of trees were on the roads, because they don't make sense. Like, those ones are fine, because it's all the trees in the area. Now, if I can get this to come up, that'd be great. Um, can I get that to be a little bit more, ni like, just nicer? <laughs> I think this is the time that I want to have a straight slope, all the way up. Yeah, something like that. That's perfect. All right. Get rid of that. Then we can keep the road down here as well, because there is still room for zoning down here. We just sort of have to go... Underneath that. I'm gonna, I don't want to get rid of that pillar. Here's what I'll do. I'll do this. Uh, the pillar is right in the middle, I believe. So I can actually just go like that. Just around it. And this can sort of push back a little bit. Might even just change this road underneath to a uh, grass line. Yeah, these roads are all like bent incorrectly. Which is interesting. Uh, so we go like more like that. You know what? Let me, let me rebuild this section here. This one just goes straight along. There they go. Then it curves here. And just curves underneath. Just to sort of avoid all the pillars. Then I might even just turn it... It should probably be a bike lane road. Let's do a bike lane road from this point. I don't think I want to join it there. I think it'll go all the way underneath. And you know what? Here's what I'll do. I'll flatten out... Uh, gotta be careful that subway. You know what? I need to rebuild that bit of subway there because it's awful. Uh, we'll do that in a second. You know what? Let's do it now because I think it's going to affect the way I'm doing the rest of this. Hopefully it doesn't... Oh no, it should be alright. I was going to say, hopefully it doesn't affect... Um, 
the line, but we're not destroying any stops, so that's fine. We're gonna go from there. Now, what we want to do, basically, is have... ...this, from 22 meters over to there... ...be a straight slope. Which is going to be annoying, because it's going to mean the curve looks a bit weird, but we can actually do it this way. Because if we... Okay, there's too many freaking screens here. <laughs> They're all overlaying each other. So if we go like that... ...that should actually... Yeah, that will keep it way lower. It means the curve is a bit weird, but it... It will be way lower down, which is great. So if I just remove that stop, they'll be up upset. And then if I just put it back, it should just update the line so it's actually where it is. Okay, that just means I'll also be able to... Um, you know what? This looks a bit weird here. Where it's sort of... I just had the bridge level and then it can just go up. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, it should just mean I can like level this out without bumping into the subway line. Which would definitely have been an issue. Now, I don't want to level out too much. We, we just basically want to level out enough for a four square zone here. And I think I'll actually have to turn that into a bridge as well. Again. Uh, yeah, four square zoning tiles is what we're after. And then this row can sort of curve up and around here somewhere. I don't know. We'll figure that out. Something like this. I can actually come back a little bit too because of where that bridge joins. And this too. Which is good because it means we can sort of play around with this a little bit. And the subway's not in the way, which is oh, lovely. Okay, so now we just got to probably update this road. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. And then we just put it back to this one. Now, let's uh, turn probably the rest of this into a bridge. Like it should have been in the first place. No, it shouldn't have been in the first place because we didn't know we were going to do this. Uh, that's fine. It actually looks good. Okay, cool. So then we can zone all of that, which is great. Probably, I don't know, offices or something or whatever it is. It also means that we have a road going underneath that doesn't have to connect to all these other things, which is good. Uh, and then this is going to go... Should just... I don't know if it should just 90 degree it. Probably not. Oh, maybe. Because we just go like this. Probably do like a key or something there because it looks a bit messy, but that's alright. Comes a little further down the road. Maybe joins up there or something. So intersection, intersection. Hopefully... I mean, they're all quite far apart. Like, especially this section has like nothing on it. I think it should be okay. So that'll come around like that. That means we can also... Yeah, zone all there, which is great. Uh, over this side... Uh, it's going to be a bit more interesting. I think maybe if I can actually just do a... That's the wrong tool. Uh, do a slope... Nope, that's the wrong... I clicked on that. You saw me click on that. Do a slope. There you go. Hang on, let me just turn up the strength of this. This whole area. Just so the whole area has changed to more of a, a gentle rising hill rather than a cliff face. It means we can actually just get some nice roads on this. And I would say houses, because that would be cool, but houses in this area really make no sense, because it's near all these major roads, all these bridges, and a heavy industrial area too, like, houses here would be gross, because your view would be that industrial zone there. So no, it'd probably be like offices or something, because I think we, we, we want this little side to here to be a little bit cleaner. Maybe even commercial could be fine here, just because we have no demand for industrial at the moment. Uh, so I'm just going to use, let's use grassland roads. So it's going to be stuck on the ground, uh, not minus three. Something like this. Like, it's just a pretty... That was actually minus three, which I don't want it to be. So that will actually fill in all of that zoning. Uh, whatever it may be, it's just... It's very curvy and very smooth, so... I guess I guess it's going to have to be offices. I mean, we could definitely do commercial. I don't know what's going on. Like, this whole bit here as well, because there's an intersection... Well, there's a node right there. It's a little bit weird. Let me just bring that up as well, because it's like the sloping and the hills around here are very odd. Hang on. Oh, wait. What am I... No, get out of move it tool. Get into the bulldoze tool. There we go. Let me just rebuild that bit, because the hill on that was kind of kind of strange. So let's go rebuild. Uh, about to there. Let me just make sure it's actually doing a smooth slope. That's a bit, a bit better, still not great. I also don't know why I'm using the oaks on this road either. Like what I was saying before about I should probably use the trees of the area. Yet right there I'm using the oaks. That's fine. Okay, so this whole area looks like it's got some roads in it. Uh, this side here just needs a little bit too and then we're good to go. I guess I'll probably just build up the same intersection instead of creating another. It shouldn't be too bad because this area is not really busy. Like it should be, it should be okay. Um, if, it, if it was going to be a... Because this is just such a small area. There's not really enough room for a lot of stuff anyway. 
So it should be okay. And I'm going to have to put that train line back in soon, which I realize. Don't worry. Uh, maybe we can just get a small lane. Because I, I wouldn't mind filling in that little section there. Something like that. Because it's only like a little section there. It should be fine with that intersection. Now, this train line is going to be more interesting. Uh, because it might even be better to bring it from somewhere here. Rather than where we had it. Just because... Oh, wait. No, the train line goes straight across, doesn't it? So it kind of needs to be there. Hmm. Because the problem is now... Got all this stuff in the way. I've got that road there. I don't want to do a level crossing. See, I'd rather keep, me, keep it all elevated, but I, I really can't unless we elevate it back here. But then it's going to be... Hmm, it's going to be quite messy then. I don't know how to do that. Well, you know, here's what we're going to do. Let's get this part of the train line back in. Uh, where, where is it? Yeah. So this part here. Elevated, thank you. Someone's already bloody... I said elevated, thank you, you prick. So we only want to be about 9 meters above the road, because that's all we realistically need to be. Um, yeah, all that's going to change, so whatever. Get out of my way, that's fine. Okay, so this is going to come round uh, through this area. I guess, actually, let me build from here first. So parallel to this road. Maybe about here somewhere. Okay, then it's going to go... Road guide, please, to the train line. At 180 degrees, preferably. There's too many... Oh, so many road guides there. Around like that. Good. Okay, so that bit's fine. Uh, so, yeah, we've skipped that train station that used to be around here somewhere, which is completely useless now anyway. Now we're going to figure out how to connect it to this bit. I guess this kind of just needs to move. It's just kind of in the way. We're going to have to maybe move that a little further down or something because it's just not going to work there. Uh, so this needs to go up 9 meters and above that road. Can you not bend, though? Or snap or go on the grid or anything. Because right now you're being a bit of a prick. There we go. I'll just go there. Alright, so then I guess I just need to connect this a little bit earlier. That's probably all I need to do. Just so it's a bit in front of me. Because that just is fine. What am I doing? I want this road. There we go. This needs to connect here, I think, instead of where it was. Okay. Something like that. But then obviously I'll curve it. And and such. Something like more like that, and then bring that out a little bit. There we go. Although I feel like that's probably too close to the tracks now. Like it, because where I built it, it was fine. But I think, I'm pretty sure those wires are running through the uh, the thing. But you know, well, it's just the way things are in the city. Really, really stupid, apparently. <laughs> This needs to, if it, that's fine if we lower it down, it just means we have to lower that so it can go underneath it, which is fine, again, but... Now, is that train line gonna be... This, this really useful train line that we have here somewhere. There we go. That's fine. Okay, so that all connects up again. So we'll see trains running down there again. Thankfully, whoa, I was really worried that we wouldn't have that train line back in. Now, before we, uh, head off, because this is a bloody long episode, uh, I want to get, um, Subway running through here before we do anything else. And I guess also we need pathways and all that. So we're going to go... I guess we're going to use that as a hub again. I wish we could add more plat... Like another platform there, because that would be ideal. But anyway, this is going to run down on this main road. Like this. Probably not all the way on the main road. Maybe even just through this little section here. So it's a little bit off the main road. Just because the main road... Yes, it's a main road, but it's not even in the... It should be... We really want to be hitting the middle of the, the suburb where most people can access it, right? So that's probably ideal. Maybe even on the corner here. It's probably where we want to go. It's like there. Where do we have? So the green line is there. So we go one, two. Maybe get another, sneak in another stop somewhere before that. Then we'll have a hub. Not a hub, but like a crossover. Like this one. Around here somewhere. Maybe this. About here. Yeah, and then the next stop will actually be here. Okay. Yeah, so then basically what we do, we go... Let's get a straight line from there to... To there. Lovely. Then this one as well, straight to there. And then this will just be a nice big curve. From there to there. Lovely. Then I'll probably just go straight along here. Like so. And then, unfortunately, we can't get another platform in there. That'd be more ideal, but it's just gonna have to share 
even that section of track there too. So we'll go in there somewhere like that. Uh, okay, so then the green line can come. Let me just pause. Drags up to move it down to this one. Good. Then we'll go there and there. Uh, Alright, so then this one is going to go... <sighs> Damn, I need, I need to download another bloody track asset so we can... Or another, another station asset just so we can use this as a... Okay, what, what, what we can do for now is actually put that on this side. That makes no difference actually because... Yeah, that makes no difference. Uh, well, anyway, let's change this asset to the plus. Which hopefully that worked fine. Okay, what? No, I want the line. I want to move. Just make sure it's actually there. I'm actually stopping there. Okay. Because we'll have one there. And then hopefully we can get this to go under up to this point. Which will change this one to a plus as well. Which again, hopefully this is fine. I keep going to the move it tool for some reason. Which I really got to stop being in the habit of. Just move it back and forth. Just to make sure it's actually there. Okay. So then we're going to go from there. Hopefully we can... Now, is the problem here that it's, yeah, it's okay, it's slope too steep, which is fine. If we just make sure we go underwater correctly. Okay, also, you need to be way lower than where those highways are, which I think is kind of the issue because they're all over the place. Hang on, where is this? Straight slope, please. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, okay, good. That's fine. Because we can start going up without hitting those. About to there. Cool, all right. Then hopefully we can get up to there. Slope too steep, Ooh. Okay, so here's what we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to try and get up there. Um, maybe if we go this way a little bit. Space already, oh yeah, I know it's already occupied, but I'm trying to go past it, that's the thing. What the hell, why is this at the same height? Move out of the way, you prick. No one wants you there anyway. No one even uses that. Oh, actually, maybe they do now. What a prick. Why is that in the way everywhere? Stupid thing. Now, ugh, now I'm not going to be able to get up. Okay, that bloody rail's a prick and a half. I'll tell you what. Uh, okay, go away. Then, you go from here. Around. How high up can this go? Underwater, realistically. About there. Okay, I was going to say, that should be fine now, right? Okay. Can we get up there? No. But what we'll have to do... Really can't do any of that? Okay, you, got, you, have, to, you have to work with me here, game. Like, you have to... <laughs> you have to make it possible for me to do this. Like, I can't do this by myself, you know? I'm going to do something like this, which is really annoying. But it's just the way it is. So this does work. Uh, not ideal. But to be honest, I don't know, because we... Oh my god. That lo what is going on with that last one? Why does it go down? Don't go down, you dumb piece of... I don't know why you always have to re-click that. That's basically the issue. Does it get to re-click the... It's not so too steep. Shut up. It's fine. How is that too steep? So it does this to get down, because it's... I mean, to be fair, it is. it has to go a fair way underground, so... I mean, it works, is, I guess, the point. <laughs> Look, that's just the way it is. All right, so for now, because we don't have um, the six, well, yeah, the six track asset, we'll just join straight up. Let me turn off Anarchy so it can actually do this properly. Um, because we don't have the six track asset. Oh, why did it do that? Can you, like, I'm building it in one big long run so that it can do it like smoothly and nice and flat and all that. And then it does crap like that. Like it builds it so poorly that I'm like, what are you even doing? Look, straight slope. There you go. Just look nice. That's all you have to do. There you go. See, look at that. It wasn't so hard. Yeah, because at the moment we don't have the asset that can do it. We'll go like this. Now, I believe it was 22 we had to be down, right? I think was the height we figured out. Hopefully it's the same here, although it does change a little bit, so... That's alright. Hopefully this will get underneath. No, it will not. I can go there, though. 
I guess because that probably that last one I don't think is as deep. Well, actually, that's fine because we're sort of heading in the right direction anyway. Uh, let's do the same thing. Straight slope on off. Connect to there. Beautiful. Okay, that 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 line is actually good, except for that. But the thing is, it'll be functional, which is the cool thing. So I guess we'll share. Which is the least busy line here? I don't know. Because we'll. I guess we'll just go there for now. Whatever. We'll figure it out. Uh, it's gonna come through. Gonna come through. Gonna come through. Gonna come through. Gonna share that one for now, which kind of sucks again, but it's fine. All the way up over here, which I'm hoping this new line here will be quite useful. We'll probably get rid of the, the rail line that does the same thing now, because I imagine that it's going to be a completely useless rail line. Even more useless than it was. And it was already useless. Uh, okay. And through there. Okay, so that's the new subway line, which doesn't have a name, so we'll have to get that down in the comments below. But that runs through there, which is great news. Um... Yeah, so I got that railway back. Uh, we need to do some pathways around this place, because especially around all of the subway stations. So, where's some obvious places that could use pathways? Like, I think where these roads... Okay, we need, don't need road guides, please. Uh, also, just be straight. Also, be on the ground. Also, adjust by the grid. No, don't be elevated. There we go. All right. I think by all where these roads sort of just end are perfect points that you could just have walk through pathways like this. Because it's just like, such a, it'd be so annoying if you couldn't just walk through there, you know? Like, I think something like this, like that. Down through all of these. Um, of course, we'll do crossings everywhere as well. Uh, and then this guy here, I can go through to that bit. That's fine. You can go through to there. This little laneway. I guess actually probably like to the side. To there. Same with this one, you can go down that way. So just make sure all these dead-end roads are connected. I think that's probably fine like that. Uh, I think these are fine when they're like that. I think that works, but I'll just put a little bit of path there anyway. Uh, this could, sh could and should definitely just go through there. Back up that way. Maybe up this way as well. Mm -hmm. There somewhere. Now this could definitely go to there. And down. Lovely. That'll go up. Uh, this guy can go straight along there, and probably down as well. Lovely. Uh, well, that's a cliff there, so I won't actually join that with a pathway, because I feel like that probably wouldn't make a lot of sense. So now we're sort of connected all the way through as a grid, like with pathways, which is good. Uh, I feel like this could probably have a pathway right there as well, just for convenience sake. Let's get it on the actual corner, where it looks a little bit neater. I said where it looks neater instead of where it's doing this big splo Stop splodging it. It's splodging all over there for some reason. I don't know why, but it is. All right, so the all the subway stations, as long as they're connected all the way through, that's kind of what matters. It looks like they are. They all have pretty good locations. That one's probably fine as well. Yeah, I don't think we need pathways through there. They can just walk around. And we've got like cycle lanes everywhere too. That'll be quite helpful. All right, let's um, get some crossings in where we put all these pathways, or at least in the spots that need them, like there and all of these as well. Otherwise, they're going to have to go there and walk all the way around, defeating the purpose of the pathway. So we want to have crosswalks. That's probably fine. They're kind of near enough to that there that they don't really need it. We'll get one in there, though. And one there. And one there. And not one there. That's fine. Not one there. That's already got one. Uh, doo -doo -doo. I've probably missed some because I've put so many pathways in. I guess we'll get one here in between these two. So they can sort of be like, oh, oh, there we go. No, there's, oh, this one could use one. Uh, that's fine. I think the rest are probably pretty good. I mean, actually, you know what? Let's get a pathway through here, because this looks like a really big spot that could easily use a pathway going through in the middle of it. Oh, yeah, that'll, that'll be good. That'll be a good pathway, I reckon. It's going to be one of the best in the city. Like this, all the way through. Sorry, guys, your place is gone. Sorry, guys, your place is gone. Sorry, guys, your places are gone. Oops, I don't think I even went up the whole way. My bad. There we go. Okay, so now you can just walk all the way through, all the way down to the beach. Lovely. That's good. Or you can just go on the road. Obviously, they have no power or water at the moment. Uh, let's, I guess, quickly just get that in. Uh, and then we'll probably call it a day there. A, 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 a day there. And we'll come back next time and, I guess, zone it all. And actually get stuff building in here. And that should be a nice little completion to this 
area anyway. We've had this big blank space here for a while. Uh, we could probably use more sewage treatment soon. Oh, that's what I need to download. I need to just download more assets and stuff, don't I? Just in general, not just sewage treatment, but just in general. I need more stuff, more things. Um, I want to get... Um, because a lot of you guys are suggesting as well just getting some more unique buildings and that. And j it, just the ones we have in game, but also downloading some newer, different unique buildings from the workshop. Which I think I should probably go through, have a look for some. If you have any suggestions, put them in the comments. You cannot link them in the comments just because the way it is, like, links don't work. But just, like, if there's a cool asset that you think I should check out, just, just tell me the name of it in the comments. Be like, hey, check out this asset. Cool park number one. Or something like that. Just let me know and I'll have a look. Because I... I'm always on the lookout for new things. And I think we could definitely use some- Oh, actually, that's what I didn't mention. I probably should have mentioned this at the beginning. Um, I actually uploaded this city from part 39 to the workshop. Um, so you can download the park after part 39. There's a lot of dead people around here. Maybe we should get, just get a crematorium in again. Um, just quickly. Yeah, you can download the park from last episode on the workshop and do whatever you like with it. Uh, so that's cool. So if you want to check it out and do some stuff and build some things, let me turn up anarchy. So we could put it like in here or something. Maybe even over here, like in this weird little spot that we had, because it's kind of like, you know what, this actually might be a good spot for it. Can I just put it there? I can. Yeah, that's because it's like a separated spot, separated by that road and these major roads. So it's kind of like, be good, it's away from where people live. But it's also a high capacity thing with 32 available hearses. Not a lot of electricity though. Oh, that's what I need to get. I need to get the stupid un underground electricity lines. Until then, let me just um, go for some commercial. I don't want to really zone that road though. Hmm. How could we get some com like power? I guess we can get it over this way. I don't know if I want that all to be high density though. I guess it doesn't really matter for now. Let me just do this. I don't even know where that's zoning from. That path. Let me make sure that pathway goes all the way through too. That's currently not. Um, let's see if we can just get some commercial coming through here just to get a bit of power. So that can start functioning. Because yeah, I think this will all be commercial anyway. Maybe not high density. I mean, we can change it to high density later. I just don't know what I want it to look like just yet. So hopefully people can build here. Oh, they're building right there. Thanks guys. Can you build here though? And then obviously we'll have to get all the services in through this area next time as well. All the city services. Now, if you guys build in the correct locations, then we could uh, have some power. Although it appears that no one wants to build over here. Which is probably a very good reason for that. I don't think there's any... Oh my god, there's also no... Do we really not have any fire departments here? This whole area is not covered by a fire department. Good lord. Did I really not? No, I guess I didn't. Let's do it over here. Because this will, well, this will cover a large portion of it down here. All through here doesn't have one though. Maybe I did, but maybe I got rid of it at some point and I forgot to put it back. Let's put one there. Jesus. I can't believe that I did not have one. Hmm. Anyway, so there's one there now. <laughs> uh, I said I was going to do this next episode, but I guess I, I want to do it now to so get some power through here. Uh, let's use one of these police headquarters because this is kind of cool. It's a nice little area around here too. I think this is it's good. I'll get one there. Police headquarters. Is there really not... like? I was hoping that that would be a reason enough for them to want to build here with all these... Oh, okay. They, they power through there. That's fine. All right. So I just wanted that to power up so we could start getting those hearses in use and get them out because we'd start doing, having a lot of dead people around there. And I don't want another huge death wave. Actually, where did we put all those... Um, I know there's a bunch of crematoriums somewhere. Are they over here? No. I think they're... Where do we put them? They're all on a road somewhere. Maybe I might have got rid of a bunch of them. Uh, but I remember them all being lined up on a road. Oh, here. Yeah, we should probably reduce these. Although I think... It appears that we're having somewhat of a death wave at the moment because all these hearses are being used. Because I went through these once before and there's like none of them being used. Um, they're probably... Yeah, I think there's a lot of people dying at the moment, so... Oh, look at this place. They're like blue buildings. Kind of nice. Ugh. That's good. Traffic. There's actually not too bad through there. All right, well, I guess next episode we'll be back. We'll be uh, filling in this, or attempting to start filling in this entire area. We've got the new subway in there. Uh, that's that, I guess. You can download part 39 from the gallery. The gallery? The workshop. I don't know if I said gallery before. Gallery from The Sim before, so sorry about that. You can download it from the workshop and do what you like with it. Uh, but we shall be back with more after the next episode. Well, after this episode and after the break between episodes. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time, and have... An awesome day.